you into my life or whatever. Forever, feeling like you could do better, better than me. I'm wishing OT, wishing you stay. Guys, make sure you check out MuleFactory.com, link in the description, and use Owen FIFA for 5% off, guys. They sell coins and lots of other different games as well, such as like League of Legends, RuneScape, etc. Loads of different stuff for every game that you guys will be playing. Use Owen FIFA for 5% off, guys. It's quick and reliable, very easy, and they do cover the 5% EA tax. Hey guys, welcome to today. Welcome to episode number five of trading. Number twelve days of trading. And um, this is the same day actually, but I wanted to make an episode tonight again. We see the Son Yamlenka and two Angel Gamers have both sold, and we still have Bakambu and Arid. So it's around six and a half k there. So up to around twenty nine k now, which isn't bad at all. We're gonna go check special cards again, see how much his hearts guys are going for. But sadly, it looks to be yeah, like this method isn't really gonna work. But we are gonna double check now at eight point five and just see what they're really going for. And it's around eight five as an average. And if we would have got that one there, that would have been decent but what we're going to do in this episode guys is I'm going to touch on it a little bit in this but I'm going to actually have a video out tomorrow which is going to have the method in full so I'm actually I'm going to leave it actually I'm not even going to do the method in the video I'm going to wait and I'm going to show you an episode tomorrow guys and make sure you check out yesterday's video too it didn't even hit the sub boxes which made the, all, the views awful so if you go and check yesterday's out drop a comment on it guys it will help you out in the long run for the giveaway because only two people have commented so far so they're both like in the lead at the moment for the most comments on the videos and whatever because like, the top five of you guys that do comment on the most like uh, videos of them we'll get like five entries into the giveaway rather than just a single one so yeah I do recommend going and doing that but um I'm just gonna go and quickly first of all do the cam method again of course um, we haven't done that since we last actually uploaded it but yeah I'm gonna have a trade method out to, uh, tomorrow guys I've got my weekend league rewards and this episode out today and then yeah this if the weekend league rewards are pretty much my weekend league rewards and then I did the SBC as well so you might want to check that out really I'm pretty sure you will want to check it out some special packs out there just like uploading them and whatever because obviously it's a few packs I did get a couple of decent players as well actually so you may want to check it out uh, it's up to you if you do want to um, but yeah I always do upload them every week but I won't be doing next weekend because I didn't actually qualify for weekend league unfortunately so yeah it will be the last one for a couple of weeks so you know you might want to go check it out but um, we're just looking through here now um, obviously for some strikers that have been converted by people and then listed up for cheap because they just want to sell them quickly but so far I'm really up it is half past ten at night now so um, yeah I'm just going to keep looking through of course um, but hopefully we will see something. It may be a pretty poor episode, I'm not going to lie. But we will try our best and hopefully get ourselves just a couple of deals or something. Just to make some nice coins today. Because I won't have time in the evening. But I am going to stream tomorrow, guys. Yes, there will be a stream. I haven't been on for ages, but I am finally going to get back into it. So yeah, make sure you come and check that out, guys. It should be around when the second video goes up. Whether it is this video or the one this might be up at 12 o'clock if it isn't it'll be the other video but whichever one's up guys basically after that video it will be a stream so make sure you come check that out I see a Jonathan Vieira here for 1.5k in a cam I'm not going to buy that because he's normally a CM if he'd have been a CDM or a striker um, I would have done it but it's just not worth it um, but yeah pretty much no deals there, unfortunately so we're going to move on now obviously and go to the left forward method again just double check this, see if there's any deals, but it doesn't really look like anything so far. So let's drop it down to 1.5k here and just double check, see if there's anything up. With Akam here, maybe a deal. Now, if he's a minute, wait, let's just double check his normal price. Um, 4k, whoa, wait a minute. 1.4, 2k, 2k, 1.5. We're going to go buy this. I'm going to list out. <laughs> okay, we're not going to buy it. Um, no, never mind. <laughs> wow, robbed. Yeah, we're going to go down now to 1.7k, something like that here. And just check this here, Tish Manga for 1.5k. This guy got 88 pace and he's on the market for pretty cheap. And he's normally going for around 4. We're going to list it up for 1.7 and that should sell on overnight because it's not much profit. But at the end of the day, I'm not going to leave it sad there. Then we have this Kakai guy here, not worth picking up whatsoever. But yeah, um, it's always worth just having a look at him, of course. But uh, nothing there at all. And the next method you're is going to be special and then BPL. This is the other uh, informed method that I do enjoy doing at times. The cheapest ones are around, yeah, Okazaki, which is around 13k, I think, something like that. Uh, 13750 maybe is the cheapest, yep. So we're going to go snipe them here. 
at 12750 and any special BPO of course can come up with this price range so I've had some good deals before like screen cards that maybe like 15k profit I've seen someone get a Kalanisic for minimum as well so it's always worth checking this method out this one today guys isn't going to be a great bit of progress I don't really think but we may still get some deals and it does bring us another day close to the giveaway so it's worth uploading I guess and getting to get a couple of deals in this video we've had some really nice deals recently so yeah um, you just keep searching here and hopefully something will come up but nothing there so far uh, but yeah 13750 we'll just refresh it like this for like a minute or so see if anything does actually come up but it's not looking good at the moment so we will just keep searching um, the Okazaki does look pretty cheap for what his card is to be honest uh, only 13k I mean I'm gonna go back to the standard method of searching now just because there's a few coming up and whatever you never know what might pop up um, hopefully it will be something good but you never know of course yeah, just searching through here now. Hopefully, you're gonna get something. Um, that would be very nice if we could. Um, but yeah, it doesn't look like anything's gonna come up. It's unlikely they will come up like this quickly. Obviously, it does normally take a little while for them to pop up. They're not normally instant deals. But uh, yeah, never mind about that. Uh, I'm just gonna keep searching, obviously, here and see if we can get ourselves anything good. Um, come on. <laughs> God, nothing's even happening. Come on, let's get one. Nah, nothing's coming up there. Gonna go and check out some of the bronze BPL players again, because this one does work. Like, obviously, start with Scotty Matomney here. This guy, sometimes, you see here, he's going for around 2k again now. I mean, if you look, it was like 9.50 the other day. They fluctuate so much. Like, it's always worth checking out the BPL bronzes. Like, if you just literally go here, like, bronze and then BPL, and just put it in at, like, this sort of price, and then look through for the half popular players like this guy here. I know he does sell on for a little bit. Um, 1.1 there, no deal there as such. But yeah, it's always worth looking through the tuber act pump here. 1.1k, 900, 600 there. Um, nothing really as such. But yeah, it is always just worth checking them out. Like Killian Hazard here, this guy. Of course, so just more of the hype around the youngsters really that seem to make them worth a little bit more than what they are. But another way to do is just go bronze VP and get 200. You see any rares that may be worth something or whatever in the 59th, 58th minute, something like that. There are sometimes some deals up. Um, I've had a couple before, like uh, there's a centre back from Stoke that does sell on, but nothing up there as such. And then we're going to go silver now and just check it like 300 because sometimes there's deals there, like this guy here, I believe is a deal. Um, yeah, he'll sell on for 550. We'll buy him right there. And then um, just double check these guys, nothing there. Uh, so yeah, 550 for this guy, 600. We'll go 600, um, which is doubling our coins there, which isn't bad at all. Just some little methods here to show you guys. And then we'll go to 400, see if there's any rare players, because sometimes there are some rares that obviously, like, we'll check this guy here. It's unlikely he'll sell on for more. No, just an average price, really. But sometimes you get with deals like this, the Petir, the, no idea how you say it, name actually, won't even attempt it. You see nothing there again. And then you go to Football League Championship. You see here, these are going for like 300 coins again now. Um, obviously, you're getting binned at 300. 350 is the going rate for these. So, obviously, you can go and snipe here at like 250 if you have low coins and literally just move it up and down like this or whatever. But yeah, some really nice, handy little methods really there with this, of course. I'm gonna go to the shadow now and see if we can get any deals real quick. And then we're gonna do a little bit of sniping to end off the video on a couple of methods. But you see 1.6K, all players from different positions that we don't care about, so never mind about that. I'm just going to end this now guys with sniping Akadi. We'll touch on this again in a video tomorrow but this is just pretty much showing you guys Akadi and players in the Calcio A that are required for the Perlo SBC are going for so much at the moment. I'm going to show you like 7 or 8 players um, where you can make over 100k a day and it'll be like, I'll show you 5 actually, a top 5 like 100k a day of players. You see 9.3k is the game rate so if we go to 8.3 and just snipe any Akadi that comes up if we can we will make ourselves some really really nice profit after tax of course but yeah just searching here now hopefully going to see one or two and you see 8k there we win it as well so we can sell it on for 9.2k there straight away and this just oh god um so yeah 9.2k hopefully that'll sell on straight away and that is around 750 coins profit after tax i believe something like that 800 coins profit which isn't bad at all like that's going to really boost the profit 
off in this episode. It's not been a great episode, if we're being honest. But this will hopefully boost at the end here now for another minute or so. We'll do this. Hopefully try and get one more, and that should bring us up to a nice profit margin after the end of this video, which is what we're aiming for, guys. You know, there's been a lack of trading tips recently, obviously, but we're going to get back into it, obviously, from tomorrow. There's going to try and be an episode of this and then a trading tip every day because double uploads are back now. I've had to be selective recently of what I've uploaded. That's why this channel hasn't grown as much at the recent stage, just with me only having one video a day. But I'm going to be back to double uploads all the way into the start of the new year now for the next week or so. Uh, it will grind out some videos and that will hopefully gain us some subs and whatever get us on the road to 6k subs but I can't thank you all enough for this year guys obviously there's still a week left of the year and we've hit 5.7k subs there's going to be a stream of course we see another Ricardi here which is so close to getting we've seen a few now but yeah literally I can't thank you all enough for all the recent support and any support you've given me throughout like the months and any time you've been here let me know down below how long you've been subbed to the channel I'm always interested to know like little things like that or like where you're from or whatever always ask a little question so you, so you can interact with you yeah, I'm going to end the video there, guys. Thanks so much for watching. Drop a sub if you're new. And, yeah, I will see you all next time with another episode of this.